are you third grade? Are you happy? I hope you are fine. Yes, well today is Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Thursday. Thursday. Yes, and October, November, April, May, May, and it's sunny and cold. Yes, okay, so we're going to check pages 38, 39, 40, 42, and 43. Y les comento algo, hoy, en la tarea de hoy, agrego la página 33, porque... No había salido en una de las fotos pizarras, ¿sí? Cuando yo había hecho la corrección, bueno, se ve que borré, así que controlando me di cuenta que no estaba la página 33, así que agrego en la clase de hoy, ¿está? Y el que ya lo hizo, ya lo hizo, porque maybe I explain in the class, tal vez expliqué en la clase, pero en la foto pizarra no salió, ¿ok? Good. Uh, let's check, yes, let's check, 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 check. Voy a... Um, tengo los errores de los leaflets también. Hermoso los leaf, leaflets que me mandaron, ¿eh? Los que corregí. Porque acuérdense que yo estoy grabando ahora un día antes, ¿sí? Puede ser que me hayan mandado, porque hay gente que devolví. ¿Qué quiere decir que devolví? Que me mandaron en un formato que no era... Si ustedes me mandan en un formato que no es, yo no puedo corregirlo, no puedo usar las tools, las herramientas de corrección que yo uso. Voy a estar corrigiendo, corrigiendo, corrigiendo y a ustedes no les va a salir impactado. Eh, no, los leaflets no. Los leaflets no. La clase que viene tengo los leaflets. Tengo, acá es leaflets. Leaflets. Sí, porque estuve mirando los que me mandaron, pero... Lo que corregí, acá no es mistake de leaflet, acá es mistake de las sentences. Tengo los mistakes de las sentences que me mandaron con comparativos y superlativos, ¿está? Comparative, superlative. Y eh, tengo que mirar leaflets porque el leaflet tenía tiempo hasta a las 7, ayer hasta las 19, ¿está? Entonces, eh, la clase que viene digo los mistakes de los leaflets. Pero igual ya estuve mirando porque yo me pongo a mirar Está en el momento donde estoy mirando, porque hay tiempos que tengo de corrección, hay tiempos que tengo de, de grabación, ¿sí? Por ejemplo, yo ahora estoy grabando este video a la noche para que salga mañana en horario, porque mañana tengo más videos de más clases que grabar, ¿está? Entonces, eh, ojo con las sentences. Aldana, the most famous, the Beatles are the most famous band. Te faltó escribir la palabrita band. Agustina, me mandaste en un formato y te devolví. Envíamela de vuelta, así te puedo corregir. Vos me estás mandando en el formato así que tiene como una montañita. Y tiene que ser formato PDF. ¿Está? No puedo corregir eso porque no te va, no, te va a salir lo que yo te corrijo. ¿Está? Si no, en el hipotético caso de que no sepas cómo es que se hace, entonces, ¿qué es lo que tenés que hacer? Mirar el tutorial ese que mandamos. ¿Sí? Pero yo pienso que ya sabrán cómo se manda una foto PDF porque en el core también están pidiendo eso en los colegios y eso. Agustina, bueno, me, me envías otra vez y te lo corrijo. Nahuel, ojo con los comparativos cortos, Nahuel. ¿Yes? Tenemos deep. Deeper than. High. Higher than. ¿Ok? ¿Está? ¿Es it clear? Uh, después tenemos Pilar. The Everest or uh, the... Mount Everest, yes, ok, the Everest. Ah, y vos podés decir, Pilar, a frog, lo que te corregí, a frog is cleaner than uh, a dog, suponete. Uh, the highest mountain is the Everest, ok. Good. Um, bueno, Alejo, cleaning is the best. In Argentina, really, limpiar, te gusta tanto limpiar, yes, o oh, cleaning is the most, puede ser la frase, eh, cleaning is the most boring thing in the world, for example, yes, ojo Toby, muchos errores hubo ahí también, eh, acordate, dame una, un adjetivo largo, uh, beautiful, ok, beautiful, yes, entonces vamos a poner, More beautiful than. ¿Ok? Adjetivo corto. Peticito. Uh, short. Short. Yes. Shorter 
than or thinner. Thinner, yes, thinner. Tenemos vocal, consonante, consonante duplico la consonante. Duplico la consonante, thinner than. Esto es para comparar. ¿Está? Cuando es un largo, usamos así. ¿Está? Ojo, ojo, ojo. Mírate la clase de nuevo, las otras clases que presenté, porque hace tres clases que vengo dando esto. ¿Sí? Así que tenés esa ventaja de poder mirar esa clase. ¿Y es? Y si quieres decir, por ejemplo, el más, the most expensive, el más caro. The most expensive. ¿Sí? Uh, the shortest. ¿Sí? Este es un adjetivo short, cortito. Entonces le agregas EST. Yes, ok. Is it clear? Yes. yes. All right. So let's go to. Um... Bueno, y Toby, ahí fíjate todos los errores. A todos les hice la corrección abajo, pero ojo, en esto era comparative superlative. Y el que no entregó brilla por su ausencia. Atención. ¿Para qué pido las frases? Ahora ya no lo pueden entregar porque ya pasó. ¿Sí? Pero ¿para qué pido las... ¿Qué está pasando con vos, Constanza, que no estás entregando tampoco, eh? Ok. Uh, Maxi. Yes. Pónganse para el próximo trabajo las pilas. Así que tengo que controlar ahora porque eh, vi los leaflets que me fueron llegando. Que me fueron llegando. Vi que llegó el de Aldana, el de Toby, el de... Eh, Pilar El de Agus Que creo que te mandé de vuelta Porque estaba mal el formato otra vez Así que me lo volvés a enviar ¿sí? Pero por ejemplo Las frases The sentences we comparative and superlative ¿Cómo van a practicar si no me las entrega? Valentina ¿sí? uh, Maxi Maxi no tengo nada tuyo te tenés que poner al día urgente, porque si no te vas a quedar no atrasado, atrasadísimo. ¿Yes? Uh, Constanza tampoco. ¿Yes? Ok, el, rest, el resto sí entregó y se les pudo corregir. ¿Ok? Bueno, eh, la clase que viene sí tengo errores de leaflet. ¿Yes? Ok. Hay en Word, en la compu, si tienen compu, hay en Word una parte de, eh, de, los, de las tools que tiene que te dice eh, para hacer cartas, tarjetas, panfletos, y es buenísimo porque vos redactás todo lo que querés, le podés poner las fotos, ¿sí? Le podés poner fotitos, fotitos, y ahora voy a mostrar porque Aldana lo hizo así, a ella le gusta hacer porque ella trabaja con Word, hace sus escritos y eso, ¿sí? Eh, muy bien Toby también, la organización del leaflet, ¿sí? Es muy bueno está, ¿sí? Para eso, ahora tienen más tiempo, entonces con... Eh, Busquen las cosas para divertirse, cree, pueden crear, en eso de Word te digo, tiene para crear tarjetas, para crear panfletos, ¿sí? Para crear cómics, puedes crear cómics, tus propios cómics jugando en la casa, ¿sí? Así que investigar y fíjate porque está re bueno, ¿sí? Pero es la versión del 2013. La versión del 2013, muy bien, buen dato por ahí. Y ¿Sí? es, tenemos a una, una alumna invitada. Bueno, so pay attention now, shall we check? Podemos corregir entonces. Ahora, con esto no quiero decir que tenés que hacer en computadora sí o sí. No. Un leaflet se puede hacer, un leaflet lindo, un panfleto se puede hacer con colores, con brillantina, con un pedazo de cartulina, con muchas fibras, ¿sí? No quiere decir que siempre tiene que ser en digital, pero si a vos te gusta hacerlo en la compu, me lo puedes mandar en la compu porque hay muchos trabajos lindos. Y de paso practicás también y te animás a hacer cosas diferentes. Y yo si no, saca por favor, ponele onda. ¿Qué quiere decir? Si yo te pido un panfleto, el panfleto tiene fotos, tiene colores, tiene títulos con diferentes letras. Crea. No me mandes una cosa que apenas dice formosa. Y no hay nada. No hay una fotito, no hay un dibujito. Ah, pero yo no tengo para imprimir tiche porque se me acabó. Estamos en pandemia, se me acabaron los, los crayones, las fibras. Dibujar. Se puede dibujar, se puede... Sí, así que yo tengo, estuve haciendo con los otros cursos también, cada uno en su nivel. Pero la primera tanda me entregó una cosa paupérrima. Pero después se empezaron a motivar, ¿sí? Porque la teacher, ¿sí? Entonces empezaron a entregar cosas muy, muy copadas. Así que copate y hacer el trabajo bien. Acostúmbrate a hacer trabajos lindos, buenos, ¿sí? Excelentes, ¿sí? No a ser decadente con el, la clase de trabajo porque si no, eh, no van las cosas así, ¿sí? Tenés que entrenarte para la vida, ¿sí? Ok. Bueno, y hacer cosas lindas, bien hechas. ¿Yes? Ok. Bueno. 
Shall we go to page 38? 38, yes. We're going to check the activity book. Vamos a sacarnos de encima la activity book, así comenzamos la clase, porque hoy está re buena esta clase. Yes, okay. Um, number one, two rivers, a waterfall, left, straight, ahead, rivers, across, Okay, good. Two. Estoy en la página 38, eh. There are two big mountains. Seguimos también, sí. There are two big mountains. Yes. There are two deep lakes. There is a waterfall. There is a beautiful forest. It's exciting. It's exciting. ¿Ves? Ok, había que seguir, mirar el mapita y crear frases en la página 38. 38. Yes, ok. Number three. Ojo, dar direcciones. Yes. Are you on page? It doesn't matter, but follow, follow. Yes, ok. Go straight ahead. Turn right. And right again. And at the waterfall. Go straight ahead. Go left. And left again at the mountain. Go straight ahead. Go along two lakes. ¿Vieron que hay dos lagos? Go along two lakes. Turn uh, left at the mountain. And go straight ahead. Go across the forest. Cruzas el forest. El monte, el bosque. Go across the forest. The old castle, the old castle is on your left. ¿Vieron que tienen a su izquierda el castillo? O sea que tenías que hacer toda la guía para llegar al castle. Yes, ok. Vos rebobinalo y ponerlo de vuelta si más necesitas escuchar. Yes, ok, let's go to page 39. Number 2, page 39. Island, repetition. Island. River. River. No se te ocurra decir river, eh. River, yes. 3, river. 4, waterfall. Waterfall. 5, town. Town. Hill. Hill. 7, lake. Lake. Mountain. City. 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 I'm here. Vamos siguiendo. Yes, okay. Put a tick if it is okay, a cross if it is wrong. Okay, number one, exercise two. Are you there? Yes, okay. The river in picture B, acá hay que hacer frases, eh? comparte. Is wider than the river in picture A. But the river in picture C is the widest. Okay? So, Ta, 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 is wider, atender, than the river in picture B. But, y lo digo con el but, the river in picture tal is the, no te comas el, el verbo, es, is the widest. Entonces estamos haciendo dos cosas acá. Estamos comparando y estamos diciendo cuál es el más ancho, el más caro, el más lindo, ¿ok? Vamos, sí. The forest in picture A is dirtier, acordate, mira. Dirty termina así, con esta I, pero esta I pasa a la I latina. ¿Está? Dirtier, y le agregas la R, ¿yes? Dirtier than, yes, ok, is dirtier than the forest in picture C. But the forest in picture B is the dirtiest. Okay? Four. The ten. Vamos a la tent. The ten in picture B is smaller than the ten in picture A. But the ten in picture C is the smallest. Yes? Five. The bird in picture B is more beautiful. Atención, viene un adjetivo largo. More beautiful than the bird in picture C. But the bird in picture A is the most beautiful. Yes? Okay? Number five, the food in picture B is more... ¿Cómo se dice deliciosa? The... Delicious. Delicious than the food in picture C. But the food in picture A is... ¿Cómo sería la más deliciosa? The... Most delicious. The most delicious. Well done, Aldana. Let's go to page 40, ok. Acá te toca hacer traducción siempre, ¿eh? para hacer el vocabulario. Digamos que la página 
de la unidad que dice vocabulary y grammar es para hacer qué? Revision y para que te quede la listita de la unidad from the unit de vocabulario. Y te queda todo y de ahí vas a estudiar siempre. Y abajo te queda la gramática hecha que siempre te mandamos en la foto pizarra o que está acá. ¿Qué tenés que hacer con cada gramática que aparece? Highlight with the highlight term. Ok. Good. Well, ok. Are you ready? Yes or no? Ok. Number two. Bigger. Yes? Bigger. Yes? Yes or no? Yes. Ok. Puedes completar también, ¿eh? Yes, el que no lo tiene completo lo completa por si lo hizo mal. Bigger, yes. Number three, more. ¿Qué quiere decir exciting? Muy bien. Excitante. Sí. Yes, number two. Come on. Bigger. 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 Yes. Number four. Number three, more. Yes, more exciting than. Three, more exciting than. Four. De, ¿cómo sería más grande? De, no, no, no. Cuá, 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 cuá. Big. ¿Cómo digo el más grande? De, biggest. Muy bien. Wake up, lazy girl. The biggest. Yes. Vocal. Consonante. Dale, aplaudimos. Eh. Vocal. Consonante. Yes, ok, the biggest, yes, ok, good. Well, uh, number five, ¿cómo sería la más deliciosa de? Most delicious. The most delicious, y te quedó listo la 40, vamos rapidito porque ya me estoy cansando de este activity book. Yes, ok, 42, vamos, 42, yes, ok, 42, después vamos al listening. 42, ok, acordate, on, si tenés dos shelves, ¿qué son shelves? Están, estantes, ok, tenés on the top shelf y on the bottom shelf, repeat, on, on the top shelf, on the bottom shelf, por ejemplo, si estás en la ladera también te sirve. Where is the salad? Yes, ok. Por supuesto, of course, yes, ok. Well, let's go, number one. Yes, ok, number one is above or below the lemonade. Above or below? Below. Below, well done. Number three, uh, the vegetables are on the top or on the bottom shelf? In the bottom shelf. In the bottom? Or on the bottom? On the bottom. On the bottom shelf. On the top shelf. On the bottom shelf. Yes? Okay, shelf. Number four. The cupcakes, the cupcakes are above or below? Above or below? The cupcakes. Above? above. Yes, above. Yes? Number five. You have to look up or look down at the X. Up, okay. You have to look up or look down at the sandwiches. Up. No. Yes. No. Up or down for the sandwiches? Up. The sandwiches? Yes. Están en forma de triángulo. No, mi amor. ¿Dónde tenés que mirar? ¿Para arriba o para abajo para encontrarlo? No es si está en forma de triángulo. Ok. Oh, my God. Ok. Look up. O down, up, yes, ok, porque están, donde Up o down, perdón, down, ya me confundió Alana, ok, down, yes, so you have to look down, yes, para los sándwiches. Number two, well, ok, two, yes, excuse me, where are the cupcakes? They are on? Yes, they are on the top shelf, yes, ok. Uh, number three, look down, yes, they are, yes, look down, look down, yes, they are on the bottom shelf, 
Below the eggs. Below the eggs. Yes, abajo de los huevos. Brilliant. Thanks. Okay, number three. Yes, are you there? On the top shelf, the eggs are above the sandwiches. Acá tenés los eggs y acá tenés los, eh, los eh, sandwiches y aquí los eggs, yes. Abajo, above, yes. Above the sandwiches. The lemonade is on the bottom shelf or on the, uh, on the top shelf or on the bottom shelf? On the bottom, yes. Y the vegetable, vegetables are below, yes, below the cakes. Dale, repetí de nuevo. On the bottom shelf. On the bottom shelf. Perdón. On the top shelf. On the top shelf. On the bottom shelf. On the bottom shelf. Yes. Above. Above. Below. Below. Look up. Look up. Look down. Look down. Yes, ok. Todo para dar vuestra cuando tenés arriba, abajo, yes, ok. Well, let's go to page uh, 43, 43, 43, 43, yes, good, are you ready? One, two E, two E, who are you with? I'm with my mom. Three A, what are you doing? We are buying cupcakes. Four B. Why are you buying cupcakes? For my birthday. 5D, when is the party? Tomorrow at two o'clock. Let's go to exercise five. Are you there? Number one, who is your favorite singer? Aldana, who is your favorite singer? Um, Elton John. Elton John, for example, yes. Where do you go after school? Where do you go after school? Uh, English. You go to? I go to English. I go or I go to English classes? Classes of English. I go. I go or I go? I go. Muy bien. Vamos a analizar el error de Aldana. Yes? Es el error común. Yes? Si yo te pregunto, where do you go? Te estoy preguntando en presente simple. Entonces vos me tenés que contestar, I'm go. Era el error de otra persona también que recuerdo. I'm go. Yo soy ir o yo voy. Yo voy. I go to the classes of? English. English. Ok, good. So pay attention, ¿eh? Pay attention, yes? Ok, good. Um, number three. Why do you like holidays? ¿Cómo respondíamos todas las preguntas que comenzaban con why? Because, yes? yes. Why? Why do you like holidays? Because. Because I am happy in holidays? Because, because I like traveling? Because I go to the beach. Because I go to the beach, yes? Because I like the beach, yes? Um... What is your favorite food? My favorite food is pizza. It's pizza, yes? Okay, good. When is your birthday? My birthday is on the 22nd of September. When is your birthday? My birthday is on the 30th, 30th. 30th of October. October, well done. Okay, so pay attention now. Uh, let's go to exercise six and you have to answer the questions. Así como respondió Aldana, que ella hizo de modelo, vas a responder. Fíjate lo que le corregí a ella, eh. Ten en cuenta esos errores. Andro, y dibujas acá. Te dibujas on holidays, in the beach, in the mountain. Yes, okay. So, very, very quickly, we are going to go to uh, the listening on page 46. Prepara los colores, por favor. 41 primero, eh. 41. Listen and color. Yes, 41. Are you there? Have you got colors? ¿Tenés los colores? Yes. Ok, good. There we are. Listen and color. Yes. Acuérdate que vas a marcar eso y después lo vas a pintar bien. Yes, ok. As we do always. Yes. As we always do. Ok.
three. Recording twenty. Listen and colour and write. I'm right. One. Can you colour this picture now? Yes. It's beautiful. I think the children are hungry. Yes, they are. The girl's got a sandwich in her hand. Colour it yellow, please. So the girl has a sandwich in her hand. You have to colour the sandwich yellow. All right? Yeah. Well done. Ready? Two. Now I'd like you to colour the sheep. Can you see it? Yes, there are two sheep. That's right. Colour the sheep to the right of the picture, please. Can you... The sheep to the right, there are three sheep. The sheep to the right... Colour it with your black pencil, please. Acordate, tu derecha es... La izquierda es donde te suena el corazoncito. Porque, right on there. <laughs> the sheep to the right of the picture, please. Can you color it with your black pencil, please? Okay. The sh there are three sheep. Yes, barco, muy bien. No te puedo decir nada yo, yes? But, te dice un spoiler. There are three sheep. The one that is on your right, el que está a tu right, a tu derecha, is black. Yes? Come on. Chips, barquito. Ah, no. Sheep, meh. Yes? Sheep, sheep. Yes? I'm just... No, wait. The sheep I to the see. right of the pick. That's right. Color the sheep to the right of the pick, or I'd like you to color the sheep. Can you please? Okay. Two. Now I'd like you to colour the sheep. Can you see it? Yes, there are two sheep. There are two sheep, not sheeps. <laughs> because there are, those were boats, yes? But sheep, sheep, yes? Es con la I larga, sheep, yes? The pronunciation, sheep. Meh. I want you to colour the sheep on your, uh, on your right? Black, yes? Okay, that's, that's right. right. Black, come on, quickly, ready? Colour the sheep to the right of the picture, please. Can you colour it with your black pencil, please? Okay. Three. Can I colour a hill now? All right. Colour the highest of all. Cap hills. Y ahí te tenés que, acord te tenés que acordar que eran hills. Pa, pa, pa. The highest hill. You have to color the highest hills. The highest. I color it green. Green. So the highest hill. Green. Don't say, darling. You are cheating. Yes. Sí, but the highest. Yes, the highest. ¿Qué significa highest? La más. No podemos decir nada y estamos diciendo. Yes, okay. Yes. Green, come on. Color it green. The highest mountain green. Yes, okay. Come on, quickly. The very good idea. Correct. The highest. The highest. Yes. ¿Cuál es la más alta? La que está aquí. Well, okay. On the left. Eight. Four. I love the boats on the lake. The one on now the boats. Yes, because no eran barcos más grandes. Estos son boats. Botecitos. Los otros eran sheep. 
Ship o ship, ¿bien? Te das cuenta que la pronunciación te escribo para que te des cuenta. Esto es ship. Y esto es ship. Ship. Y esta es con la I cortita, ¿bien? Ship o ship, ¿bien? Ship, más largo, ¿bien? Atención, the boats. On the left is bigger than the middle of the boats on the lake. The one on the left is bigger than the one in the middle. But the boat on the right is the biggest of all. They are all beautiful. Yes, they are. I'd like you to colour one boat now. The biggest one? No, colour the smallest one. Make it red. The smallest boat, the three... Is red. Yes, is red. Okay. Five. Can I do some writing too? Yes. I'd like you to write the word lake. Where? On the signpost? Yes, please. The signpost has no name on it. So, you have to write the word lake on the sign post. Do you know what is a sign post? This is a sign post. This is the sign post. You have to write the word lake. Can you do it? Yes, write. The word lake. Come on. Está bueno esto, eh? Este es un ejercicio típico, típico de eh, exámenes de Cambridge. Yes, okay? A typical exercise from Cambridge. Exercises. Six. And now, colour the kite, please. All right. Can I colour it blue? That's a nice colour. But I'd like you to make it purple, please. Oh, OK. Thank you. Well done. What colour is the kite? The kite is purple. Yes, OK. Purple. Good. The kite. What kite? There is a kite there, it's next to the girl, between the sheep on the left and the girl that is eating sandwich. It's between the girl that is eating sandwich and the sheep. The kite, kite. Yes, come on, color it purple. Yes, okay. And let's go to page um, 46, very quickly, 46, yes. Are you there? 46, okay. Good, 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 good. Unit 4. Recordings. What are they doing? It's on activity day. Yes? Listen and write the letter. Yes? A, B, C. Okay? Are you there? Look first. Read the names. Tracy, Daniel, David and Emilia and Chloe. Yes? Okay? Yes, yes, yes. Five. What are they doing on activity day? Listen and write a letter. Hi Tracy, what are you doing? Hi Paul, I'm looking at some photos. Can you show me? Yes, sure. Look, this is activity day at school. We're doing different things. That sounds cool. Who's that boy in white? He's Daniel. He's one of my best friends. He's making cupcakes. He's really good. He wants to be a chef. It looks delicious.
Look at David and Amelia. They are in year four. Ah, they love sports. Are they playing football? No, they aren't. They are playing tennis. They play three times a week at school. What about this girl? What is she doing? Well, she is Chloe and she's having lunch in the canteen. Can't you see it? She's having a sandwich, an apple and a drink. Oh, I see. And okay. who? So you have A, kites, B, cupcakes, C, photographs, a camera, D, football, E, uh, lunch, yes, and F, tennis, yes. Okay, do you want to listen again? Listen Mash. and write a letter. Hi, Tracy. What are you doing? Hi, Paul. I'm looking at some photos. Can you show me? Yes, sure. So, Tracy said, I'm looking at some photos. Con que vas a unir? With the camera, with C. Well done. Look, this is activity day at school. We're doing different things. That sounds cool. Who's that boy in white? He's Daniel. He's one of my best friends. He's making cupcakes. What is he doing? He's making cupcakes. Case, yes, so you are going to match with letter B, yes? He's really good. He wants to be a chef. He wants to be it a chef. It looks delicious. Mm. I want David and Look Amelia. at David and Amelia. They are in year four. Ah, they love sports. Are they playing football? No, they aren't. They are playing tennis. They play three times a week at school. What about this girl? What is she doing? They play three times a week at school. What? No, they aren't. They are playing tennis. They play three times a week at school. What about this girl? What is she doing? Well, she's Chloe and she's having lunch in the canteen. Can't you see it? She's having a sandwich, an apple and a drink. Oh, I see. Okay, so we have uh, Tracy is C, David and Amelia? F. F, yes. Okay, Chloe? C. Chloe? E. E, yes, because you say they are having lunch, an apple, orange juice and a sandwich, yeah? All right, good. So this is done, yes? Now, pay attention. I want you to clear the table. Pongan un poco las cosas. And pay attention, yes? I want you to look at the wall. Yes, okay. There we are. Bye bye, unit three. Ok, hello unit 4, yes, se fue la unidad 3, hello unit 4, yes, ok, good. Good, are you there? I want you to look at the ball. Yes, can you see from there? In the picture, what can you see in the picture? What is wrong in the picture? What is wrong in the picture? Yes, is there something wrong? I would be no pegan in the picture. What is wrong in the picture? Look at the picture. Come on, look. Sorry, in English, no, in this picture. What is wrong in this picture? What is wrong? I look in Ovai. Look at the board. Mirate la pizarra. Look at the board. Yes? Yes? Look. What about her picture? Yes? She has picture. Where is the picture? Pictures. Yes? 
a upside down, están dadas vueltas las pictures que tiene. ¿Te diste cuenta? Estas de ahí. Yes, on the yes. board. Yes, ok, míralo bien en tu libro después. Yes, upside down. Yes, está en pata para arriba. Yes, ok. The picture on Lois' board is upside down. Yes, ok. Yes. Good. Well, and how many landscape words can you find in the picture? Landscape, a ver, fíjate si podemos ver algunas que digan hill, river. ¿Hay alguna? Yes or no? Oh, yes, hay un lake. Lake, what else? Mountains, I don't know. Mountains, yes. Yes, okay. Uh, lake. Lake, hills, hay hills? Hills, waterfall, hay una cascada? No. Waterfall, uh, river, hills, yes, okay. Oh, yes. Yes, did you see? Yes, there is, okay. Three plates of sandwiches, ¿encontraste? Tres platos de sandwiches? Yes. Three plates of sandwiches, yes, okay. Uh, two bowls of crisps, acordate, Pilar, crisps, las papas fritas, las deshidratadas, las leyes. Crisps, two bowls of crisps, yes, there is one here, yes, two bowls, yes, okay. Dos bowls de crisps, yes, okay. Um, sandwiches, yes. Did you find the sandwiches? Yes, yes. it's next to uh, the bed. Uh, on the floor, between the table and the bed. Yes, okay. Uh, what is there on the lotus bed? Yes. What is there? A robot. Yes, okay. Yeah. Yes. His name is Wolf. Sorry? His name is Wolf. Yes, good. Yes, all right. Well, so I like this picture. But look, it has a lot of things there. There are a lot of things there. Yes, so you have to see. And what are these? Look, they are playing. They have jobs. Yes, it's a policeman, a policeman. Uh, what else? They have a lot of jobs. Mira tu libro, eh? Okay, good. So pay attention. We have here, we have a scientist. Repeat. Scientist. Farmer. Farmer. Firefighter. Firefighter. Police officer, police officer, waiter, waiter, or waitress, waitress, waiter, a camarero, mozo, or camarera, moza, yes, okay, actor, actor, actress, actress, que no suena mucho actress. ese actor, sino actor, actor, actress, actress, mechanic, mechanic, musician, musician. chef, yes, chef, bet, bet, singer, a bus driver. Acordate que adelante de las profesiones siempre vas a poner E o A. Si dice actor, comienza o actress, comienza con una vowel. ¿Qué va a ir? E o an. An actor, an actress. Yes. A bus driver, a mechanic. ¿Ok? ¿Es clear? Good. Well, um, I want you to tell me, um, what is your favorite job? What's your favorite job from here? A waitress, a farmer, a scientist, a writer. Actress. Yeah. An actress. Yes. Yes. Would you like to be an actress in the future? Yes, no? No, because I don't know. No? I don't want to kiss anybody. Yes. Would you like to be a writer? Yes. Why? I because I like... I love the books. You love? The books or books in general? Books. You love books in general. And do you like writing? Acordate, si quiere decir me gusta. Because I like más el verbo con ing. I like writing. Uh, uh, would you like to be um, a police officer? Would you like to be an actress? Yes, because I like acting. Y vas a poner ese acting con ing. Da, me gusta comer, correr. Ok, is it clear? Good. So pay attention now. I want you to go, I want you to go to, um, uh, don't go to any page yet. Yes. Okay. Good. Are you there? So, do you know them? Yes. Do you know all McDonald? Yes. yes. Who are, uh, tell me, who works 
works with animals here? Who works? Who works? ¿Qué quiere decir who works? ¿Quién trabaja? ¿Quién trabaja? Yes. ¿Quién trabaja con? Dale, te toca, eh. Who works with animals? From here. Old MacDonald. Old MacDonald. Do you know Old MacDonald? Well done. Old MacDonald had a farm. Yeah, yeah. And on the farm he has a sheep. Yeah, yeah. With a meme here, with a meme there. Here, meme, meme, everywhere a meme. Old MacDonald had a farm. Yeah, yeah. Yes, okay. Good. Well, esto es para, by the way, eh? para ablandar un poco. Okay, so who works with uh, animals? The farmer, yes, a farmer, who uh, cooks delicious meals. Delicious meals? Meals, meals, comidas, meals, delicious food. Gordon Ramsay. Yes, the chef, a chef, yes, a chef, okay. Who looks after people when they are sick? Yes? Who looks after? ¿Qué quiere decir looks after? Cuidar. Looks. ¿Por qué le estoy poniendo la S acá? Porque ¿qué tiempo lleva S cuando es he, she, he? Present simple o present continuous? Present simple. Ok. Who works? Who looks after? Yes. Who looks after? Yes. A uh, sick people. Parents. Yes. But what? A doctor? A nurse? A nurse. A nurse. Well done. And we have Florence, Na Florence Nightingale. He was a she was a famous nurse. A famous nurse. And she was also a writer. ¿Sabían que ella era también escritora? Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Las chicas que están leyendo el libro de chicas um, cuentos para chicas rebeldes sale Florence uh, Nightingale. Yes, Nightingale. And she was a famous um, nurse. But who else? Quien más looks after the patients? Wait. The patients. Los pacientes. Who looks after patients? Yes? A chef? A doctor? A singer? A doctor. Yes? A doctor. Acordate que looks after es cuidar. Yes? So, the person who looks after uh, patients is a doctor, the doctor. The person who looks after patients too is the nurse. Yes, yes. okay. And um, who sings beautiful romantic songs? Elvis. Elvis Presley. Yes, Elvis Presley. And look, he's a what? A sing? Yeah. Singer, a singer. Then we have actress, actor, scientist. Who um, acts? Who acts in films? Who acts in films? Marilyn Monroe. Marilyn Monroe and Leonardo DiCaprio. Leonardo DiCaprio. So we have. Uh, she's an actress. And he's an actor. Acordate que cuando querés esta, hacer esta pregunta, siempre vas a hacer esto. Who works with? Who looks after? Who sings beautiful songs? Yes. Okay. Yes. Good. Who finds um, the cure for cancer? A scientist, for example. Yes. Entonces, ahí tenés todas las profesiones. Yes. Y pusimos gente conocida o gente que deberías conocer that are very famous. Okay, farmer, farmer chef, chef, doctor, tenemos a René Favaloro, he was a famous, famous doctor. Yes, Elvis Presley, Elvis Presley, Elvis Presley. he's a singer, Marilyn uh, Monroe, Marilyn an actress, Monroe. she was very beautiful. Yes, Leonardo DiCaprio, yes, yes. actor, uh, Florence Nightingale, yes. she was a nurse, and scientist Stephen Hawking. Stephen Hawking, yes? Yeah? Okay, Stephen Hawking. Yes, okay. Well, um, good? Yes. Good. Wait a minute. Espérate que la teacher está 
organizando sus pictures que te quiero mostrar. Well, so pay attention now. Yes, acuérdate que en la primera parte hicimos presente simple, presente simple usábamos para routine or activities we are doing now. Activities, no, routine. Routine. And present continuous what activities, activities we are? Activities. We're doing now. We are doing now. Okay. Si yo te pregunto, what are you doing now? I am writing. I am writing. What is uh, he doing? He is... Ring, ring, dang, 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 dang. Number 11 doing. What is 11 doing? La 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 la. Who's? He's. La 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 la. I want you to tell me. Come on. He's. Sing. He's singing a song. Singing a song. Ok. ¿Te acuerdas del presente continuo? Él está cantando, él está bailando. This is revision. Esto es revisión de tiempos que van a aparecer siempre. Vamos a revisar siempre los tiempos verbales y lo que va a ir cambiando va a ser el nivel de dificultad de los ejercicios, ¿ok? So, uh, number 8 is playing the guitar, uh, number 11 is singing a song, um, well, ah, the mechanic, what is the mechanic doing? He's repairing, he's repairing, you know what is repairing? Repairing a car, yes or no? Yes? Ok, entonces teníamos con am, ¿qué voy a usar? I am, you are, ¿qué más va con are? We, we they, they, and with is, he, she, and it, yes, ok, is it clear? Acordate que el presente continuo formamos con sujeto más am, are, ois, más el verbo con ing. ing. Muy bien. Yes, ok. Bueno, and now pay attention. Ya te repasamos present simple con las profesiones. Ya repasamos present continuous y ahora nos vamos a otra cosa nueva de hoy. So pay attention now, concentrate. Me concentro por favor porque sé que a lo mejor... Te desconcentrar. Yes, concentrate. Yes. Ok. Ok. I want you to tell me. Quiero que me digas verbos de la escuela. ¿Qué haces en la escuela? What do you do at school? Uh, learning. Sí, en simple nomás. Sí, sí, en el Learn. 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 Ok. Study. Study. Leer. Read. Read, ok. Uh, mm, mm, hablar. Speak. Speak. Play in the playground. Play in the playground, in the break. Ok, con eso me conformo. Ok, now, ahora lo que vamos a ver va a ser lo siguiente. The things you must do and the things you mustn't do at school. ¿Qué será que quiere decir I must? For example, I must study at school. ¿Qué quiere decir I must? Yo de bo. I must study at school. Mm. What else? Otra cosa que debes hacer en la escuela. I must study. I must study. Ya dijimos, estaba, estaba volando, flying away. Learning. Voló, Aldana, flew away. <risa> yes. I must, no estamos agregando ING acá. Estamos ocupando el verbo solito. I must I study. Must learn. I must learn. I must read. Yes. I must speak. I mustn't speak in class. Oh. In class. En los recreos sí. ¿Qué quiere decir I mustn't speak in class? No debo. No debo 
hablar en clase, yes? Okay, I mustn't speak in class. I mustn't play in class. Okay, good. Is it clear? Okay, so these are the things that you must do. Significa yo debo, ¿sí? Okay, I must speak, I must play, I must read, I must study, I must learn. Dale, vamos punto. I must learn. I must learn. I must study. I must study. I must read. I must read. I mustn't speak. I mustn't speak. In class. I mustn't play in the I class. I mustn't play in the class. Okay, because the teacher is giving the class, of course. Entonces tenés más y el verbo tiene que estar en infinitivo. Quiere decir que no le agrego, no es ese y en general. I must speak. I must work. I must study. I must. Se olvidaron de algo muy importante que sí o sí tenés que hacer. That you must do para poder aprender. ¿Qué es lo que te da la teacher Ruth siempre? Lista de consignas. I must. ¿Cómo es hacer la tarea? I must do. Do the homework. Do the homework, yes? Okay, homework. All right, okay. Good, so pay attention now. Look, mirate que bueno que está este cuadro. Sí, acuérdate que las teachers de Econo están mandando los cuadritos, estamos haciendo cuadros con los teachers para que tu clase sea copada, para que te divierta. Sí, okay. Atención, pay attention. Ta ta ta. Can you read, Alana? You must and stand up, darling. Stand you up. Must meet home. You must do your homework. Stand up. Stand up. Come on. Ready, steady, go. Do and um, you must do your homework. You must listen to the teacher. You must study for exam. Study. Study. For your exam, you mustn't. Use your mobile phone. Mobile phone. Eat food or drink. Run in the classroom. You mustn't run in the classroom. Is it clear? ¿Te quedó claro? Well, these are the things you must do and you mustn't do. Okay, good. Now let's go to the pages. Ahora sí vamos a las pages. Well, all right. Okay, good. So pay attention now. Yes. Yes, I want you to go to the pages very quickly. Yes, you are going to go to pages 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, and 53. Yes, from the classbook. Acuérdate que estas son las páginas que hacemos con la videoclase, conmigo. Después lo otro lo hacemos solo en casa. Yes, ¿te gustó la presentación de las cosas que vimos hoy? Yes, ok. Me encanta que te guste. Porque todas las cositas las preparamos con mucha onda, yes, ok, 48, 49, 50, 51, uh, 52 and 53, yes, ok, te das cuenta que vos me importás, nos importás muchísimo, ¿sí? te preparamos día a día tus clases para que te llegue a la casa y vos te sientas bien, no te sientas que te paró esto de el virus ni nada por el estilo, ¿sí? así que muy bien que elegiste no quedarte en el camino, y seguir aprendiendo inglés en el Instituto Reino Unido. Ok, que luego una propaganda, chicos, ¿eh? Ok, well, good. Um, good. Exercise 4. ¿Hay idea? Pero este ya lo hicimos, que es lo que teníamos que encontrar en la picture. Yes, ok. Todos los cuadritos que tienen su bathroom, que, es, que lo proyectamos ahí. Yes, ok. Yes, wow. Oh my God, there are, ¿vieron los professions que tiene ahí? Chef, doctor, yes, in these charts, yes. What is the first thing that you have to do when I say the, the pages? Put the date in all the pages. Yes, today is Thursday, the uh, 7th of May, yes, okay? Good, so let's go very quickly. We are going to listen, point and repeat, yes, okay? Mientras la teacher busca el audio, vos te vas organizando. You organize your time. Espera. Unit 4. All about job. Hacé letra linda, no hagas letras así todas medias de, 
película de terror. ¿Yes? Recording one. Let's repeat. Listen, point, and repeat. And point. Scientist. Scientist. Farmer. Farmer. Firefighter. What are you doing now? I am speaking. What are you doing? What are you doing? I am learning. Learning. What are you doing? Are you eating? Yes, I am or no, I am not. Are you drinking Coke? Yes, I am or no, I am not. No, you are studying. I'm studying. I'm teaching. You are studying. Okay. What is your mother and your father doing? They are cooking? They are drinking mate? They are working? Yes. What are we doing now? What are we doing? ¿Qué significaba we? ¿No so? ¿No so? Yeah. Okay. We are learning. Estamos aprendiendo. Okay. Uh, police officer. Police officer. Waiter. Waiter. Waitress. 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 Actor. Actor. Actress. Actress. Mechanic. Mechanic. Musician. Musician. Chef. Chef. Vet. Acordate que el chef es el jefe de cocina, ¿eh? Y el cook es el cocinero. En una cocina hay muchos cocineros y hay un chef que es el jefe de cocina que está... Por eso siempre los otros cocineros en la película le dicen, sí, chef, le dicen, ¿sí? Ramsey, este que estaba ahí, es el chef, ¿sí? Tiene estrellas Michelin, no sé cuántas estrellas Michelin tiene Ramsey, tres estrellas Michelin, o sea que, oh my God, sí que es bueno, ¿eh? Okay. Well. Singer. Singer. Bus driver. Bus driver. All right. Now, let's go to exercise four. ¿Están listos? Prepara tu lápiz, rapidito. Who works with animals? Bet. A bet. Dale, pone rápido. A bet. Who uh, works in the theater, TV, or film? Actor. Actor or... Actress. Acordate que va an actor, an actress. Unit. Yes. Who works in a restaurant? Dale, vamos a hacer más movido. Dale. A chef. Muy bien. ¿Qué más? A waitress. A cook. A cook and a waiter. Yes. Okay. Who, who helps people? Who helps people? A firefighter. Yes. A police officer. A police officer, a firefighter, who works mostly outside with animals. Granjero. Eh, Old MacDonald had the farm. Ia, ia, oh. And on his farm he has a sheep. Ia, ia, oh. Can, can, with a man, man, here, with a man, man, there. <laughs> here, man, there, man, everywhere, man, man. Old MacDonald had a farm. Ia, ia. Pam, pararam, pam, pam, pam. Yes, okay, good. So, uh, let's go to pages 50 and 51. Acordate que cuando te salen de la activity, que no te dé pereza, yes, don't be lazy, porque en el activity te sale, en el activity tenés, ¿qué cosa? Pregunta sobre la historia, question about the story. Ay, no, no entiendo nada. Me voy a bajar nomás del classroom, no entiendo nada, no sé ni cómo van a teacher. Yes, no. Don't do that, yes? Anda al book, y en el book están las respuestas que necesitas para el class, para el activity book, ¿sí? Porque en esto necesitamos hacer esto para la parte de skill, de reading skill, ¿sí? Para trabajar esta eh, habilidad, necesitar ir al texto, scan the text, and look for information, ¿ok? So don't be lazy, yes, ¿ok? Listen to a story. Prepare the highlighter. Prepare the highlighter. Unit 4. Recording 2. Listen and read. The Burglar. What are you doing, Lois? I'm watching Ash. ¿Vieron que hay un antifaz ahí? suelen usar esos antifaces? Delincuentes. Los burglars. Repeat. Burglar. Repeat. 
Burglar. Marca con el highlighter el título directamente. The burglar. Yes. Okay. This house. There's a car outside the house. The burglar. What are you doing, Lois? I'm watching Ash's house. There's a car outside the house. And? Well, Ash and his fat. There's a car outside Ash's house. Oh my God, this is mysterious. Very, very mysterious. And the aunt at home. They're visiting friends today. So, who is it? He's upstairs. That's weird. Weird. That's weird. Marca esa palabra. Eso quiere decir extraño. Pone con el lápiz, por favor. Highlighter. Upstairs. No, upstairs is arriba, downstairs is abajo, yes? Weird, weird. Look! Listen to that sound. But nobody, it, there is nobody upstairs in my house. Oh my God, that is weird. What is weird? Extraño. ¿Le pusiste que significa extraño? Yes or no? Yes. Acuérdate que tienes que trabajar con el highlighter y con una... Pen or pencil. <gasps> Maybe it's a burglar. A burglar? I know. Let's send Bo over there. Bo. The robot. Bo, what are you doing? Look, I'm a mechanic. No, you aren't. Never mind that. Can you listen? Never mind. Huh, never mind. No. Never mind. No importa. Eh? Bo! There's someone in Asher's house. Please go and watch him. What's he doing? I'm going in. He's going in. He's wearing jeans and a yellow jacket. He's opening the fridge. He's drinking some milk. But he isn't eating any food. Now he's closing the fridge. So I want you to highlight all the present continuous sentences. Dale, he's wearing, come on. He's opening, come on. He's drinking, come on. He isn't eating, yes? He is closing the fridge. ¿Vieron todas las uh, sentences in present continuous? Yes? Okay. Hay una más. He's, picking. He's picking up the car keys. What is this? Pick up the keys. Pick up. What is pick up? Llaves. No, keys are llaves. But what is pick up? Agarrar. Agarrar, levantar, pick up. Y también pick up es eh, la, la camioneta, pick up. Lottie, we must call the police. Call 999, now. Okay. Yes, or another sister. 
Yes? ¿Encontraste? There is a picture there. Yes. Yes, los primos. Yes, maybe it's a cousin or another member of the family. Yes, okay? Good. So let's go there. Yes, it's the cousin. It's Ash, Ash cousin. Yes, okay? So, rapidito. Louis thinks there is a burglar in Ash house. Number four. Bo watches the burglar. The girl called the... ¿A quién llaman? Police. The police or police? Police. Police, yes, okay. Complete, please. The burglar sees... ¿Por qué ese verbo tiene S al final? ¿Por qué está en present simple o present continuous? Present simple. Present simple. ¿Es present simple for routine o for activities we are doing now? For routine. Routine. Sis, a bo. Ash and his, uh, and his, mm, come home. ¿Y quiénes llegan a la casa? Ash uh -huh. and his, pe. Uh -huh. Ash and his, parents. Muy bien. Acuérdate de tachar las palabritas que están arriba cuando las vamos usando. They find Bo, the burglar, and Lottie and Lois in the house. The burglar isn't a boy, it's a... Um, Alisa. Look, tenemos las palabras arriba, Alana. A cousin. No, the, the burglar isn't a boy, it's a... Girl. It's a girl, well done. She is Ashes. Cousin. Cousin. No me pronuncies cousin, eh? Cousin. Repeat. Cousin. Cousin. Es como una, una A. Yes? Okay. Let's go quickly to page uh, 52. 52. Yes? ¿Estamos? Yes or no? All right. Yes. Look back. Tick the sentence in the picture. Dale. What are you doing? He's opening the door or he's picking up the car keys? ¿Qué estás haciendo? Pick, pick, picking pick, up the pick car up. keys. Marcatela, por favor. Yes, con un tick. Yes, ya está. Ready? Good. And now we're going to highlight the chart. Subrayate el cuadro. I'm watching Ash House. They aren't playing cards. Are you wearing a green jacket? Yes, I am. No, I am not. ¿Qué tiempo es ese? Le pones al lado present continuous. Yes? Ponele al lado present continuous. ¿Ya está, Aldana? Did you highlight the chart? Yes, okay. Y le pongo present continuous. Is it clear? Yes? Yes or no? Yes, yes? The presenter. Acá tenemos que saber descubrir quién es el que está presentando. Atención, eh. Are you ready for the listening? Yes. Good. Unit four. Recording four. Listen. Who is the presenter talking about? Who is the presenter? Say the numbers. Hello and welcome to the Barhaven Job Fair. This is Radio Barhaven and we're finding out all about these jobs. Hello, what's your name? My name's Sam. And what are you doing, Sam? I'm cooking. What number is it? Four. Four. Well done. Great. I'm Sam. How about you? What are you doing? Well, I'm looking after this dog. It's ill. But two. Oh dear. Yes, number two. What's her job? What does she do? What does she do? She's a vet. Yes? Acordate. La pregunta para preguntar, para la redundancia. What do you do? ¿Qué significa what do you do? I'm a teacher. What do you do? I'm a student. Yes? What does your mom do? She's a vet. Pilar, what does your mom do? What does your mom do? She's a dentist. Okay. She is a dentist. Yes. Okay. What do you do? I'm a teacher. I'm a teacher. Yes. 
Noé, esta pregunta es, ¿qué haces? What do you do every day? Sí. I wash my, uh, my car, I clean my teeth, I teach. Pero cuando nos queremos referir de qué haces como profesión, vas a preguntar, what do you do? Repeat. What do you do? What does your mom do? What does your mom do? What does your dad do? What does your dad do? Okay, he's a cook. Yes, is it clear? Yes, all right. Get well soon, doggy. How about you? I can hear what you're doing. Yes, we're playing the violin. Number three. Three. The music sounds fantastic. And how about you? What are you doing? Are you singing? No, we aren't. We're acting. To be or not to be. That is the question. To be or not to be? That is the question. Who's this? Shakespeare? Shakespeare, yes? Okay. And... No, 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 the pride of Britain. <laughs> okay, to be or not to be, that is the question. Esa es una frase re célebre de William Shakespeare. Aprendete la. Obviously, darling, obviously. It's a, uh, to be or not to be, yes, that is the question, yes. No es que tiene ahí la calavera, yes, okay. Great. Now, look at Number the... five. This was number five. Those people. ¿Cómo se dice una obra? A play. Como play de jugar, a play es una obra también. What are they doing? They're wearing black and white. They're standing by the tables. They aren't eating. Ah! I... What number is it? They are standing next to the tables. They are wearing black and red, but they are not eating. Number one, yes, waiter and waitress, yes. See, they're serving drinks. They are serving. Time for a coffee. Yes, okay. Ah, no, son dos, yo pensé que era una chica, una blonde girl. No, son dos waiters, yes, waiters. Waiter, yes, no waitress, yes. Muy bien, Aldana. Okay, let's go to exercise um, page one, uh, page 53, exercise one, listen, point and repeat, yes? Acuérdate que siempre la teacher te presenta el tema, cuando vas al libro ya lo sabes todo. Prepara el highlighter, and I want you to highlight all the verbs, subrayate todos los verbos que están ahí, yes? Come on, highlight them, please, while the teacher is looking for the listening. Unit four, No quiero que hagas con una cosa que no sea highlighter, eh? Tenés que tener tu highlighter, eh? Six. Listen, point, and repeat. Put litter in the bin. Put the litter in the bin. In the bin, yes? Okay, bin. Litter is rubbish. Ponela abajo rubbish también, porque litter es basura. Y vos sabés también que se dice rubbish, que dimos la clase pasada cuando dimos la lectura de la nenita esa que tiraba los rubbish, que reciclaba. Así que se ponían gloves para juntar la rubbish. Drop litter. Drop litter. Follow the rules. Follow the rules. At school, you must follow the rules. Must es, un, es una gramática que es re fácil. A mí me encanta porque es must, más el verbo, y le pones you must, ¿sí? Y el verbo que querés hacer. You must watch TV, you must study, you must listen to the teacher. Debes y tal. Es re fácil y es re linda. Break the rules. Break the rules. Shout in class. Shout in class. Repeat. Be quiet in class. Be quiet in class. Arrive on time. Arrive on time. ¿Qué quiere decir arrive on time? Llegar. You must arrive on time. Yes, you mustn't be late. Eso le digo siempre al Dana. Okay. Well, first of all, you are going to highlight the charge. Subrayate el char de must ahí. 
you must be quiet in class, you mustn't break the rules, yes, okay. No, hay que subrayar, eh, highlight nomás, porque ya tienen ustedes, van a tener en el, la foto pizarra y tienen en el libro. Acuérdate que todos los cuadros gramaticales tienen que estar marcados en el libro, en el activity book, ¿yes? Um, ¿Se entiende? Exercise 5. Completate el ejercicio 5. Rapidito. Con más o más. Dale. Más o más. Yes. Más o más. Ya termina la clase. Ojo, eh. ya nos vamos. Más, más. Acordate que es toda la clase la que tenés. Eh. Así que hay que moverse. Eh. Must or must? Ya está? Ready. Ready? Okay, so let's check. Number one, can you read, Aldana? You must? You must arrive. Arrive or arrive? Arrive on time to take the bus to school. Okay, the bus. Number three? You mustn't play with fire. Number four? You must be quiet, quiet, in the cinema. Quiet. You quiet. must be quiet. Repeat. You must be quiet in the scene. Okay, good. Well, that's all and I want you to go to the song. Vamos a la canción, por favor, y terminamos con esta canción. Acordate que no es para recibirte de cantante, yes, sino para mejorar. Dale, rapidito. What's the bus driver? Yeah. What's the bus driver? Say... Unit 4. Recording 8. Unit 4. Recording 7. Listen and sing. Ok, subraya todas las más, dale. You must buy your ticket. Subrayaste. You mustn't drop the litter. ¿Qué quiere decir litter? Basura. Yes, ok. Vamos al segundo párrafo. You must put your litter in the bin. Yes, ok. Vamos al de al lado. You mustn't shout. You mustn't be late. Yes, ok, good, miren, así te tiene que quedar, ok. ¿Es el clear? En la canción, dale, vamos, come on, hurry up. What's the bus driver saying to you? You must buy your ticket, you mustn't drop any litter. Where are you? Cuando dice where are you, hacemos así. Where are you? Where are you? What's the office? The police office is saying, the police officer saying, acuérdate que siempre hay, el primero es un bus driver, en el segundo es police officer, en el tercero, dinner lady, ¿qué era la dinner lady? La señora que serves the food in the school. At school, muy bien, at school. Y el último dice, what's the teacher saying? Quiet, please, esto dice siempre la profesora, porque las chicas y los chicos gritan en la escuela. Quiet, please. You must be quiet. Okay? Si quieres ponerte de pie, si no, no. Yes, stand up or follow here. The bus driver saying to you. Y ahí lo que te dice el bus driver. Yes, ok. El colectivero, el conductor de colectivo, yes, del bus. You must, yes, buy your ticket. Dale. El que quiere bailar, baila. El que no mira y se ríe de lo que está Yeah.
Bye bye. bye. See you next class. Bye bye. bye.